Samsung Knox Enterprise Firmware Over the Air, or eFOTA, gives you greater control over mobile OS updates and patches, allowing you to validate, approve, and deploy new versions of your OS to devices like the Galaxy XCover Pro. Without a solution like eFOTA, unplanned OS updates can wreak havoc on productivity, especially if they create incompatibilities with your business-critical mobile apps. In this video, you'll learn how to schedule updates and patches with eFOTA for a fleet of XCover Pro smartphones. Let's start by learning how to enroll your company's XCover Pro devices in eFOTA. You can register devices to the eFOTA service through Knox Mobile Enrollment or manually register within the eFOTA console. To do this, provide your IMEI information and customer ID to your reseller. Find it by going to your phone, clicking Settings, and navigating to About Phone. Now, to find your customer ID, click on the circular button on the upper right-hand corner of your browser and copy this information. To verify that your devices are registered, select Devices on the left pane, then select All Devices. Your device will appear in the list. An eFOTA campaign is where you stage an OS update. In eFOTA, select Campaign on the left pane and then select Create Campaign to start. Give your campaign a name. You can set your campaign to start on a specific date. Use the drop down menu to select your time zone and specify the date and time you want to install the campaign software. To ensure the installation happens on a certain day, choose Set a Start Date Only instead of Set Period. You can allow the end user to postpone the installation up to one, two, or three times. You can also specify parameters to ensure that the campaign executes on all your devices. Choose the network type for update, selecting either Wi-Fi only or Wi-Fi or mobile. You can also specify that devices must have at least 20% battery life to begin the update. To play it safe, select Allow Installation Only When Connected to a Charging Dock. Lastly, don't forget to enter your contact information so your end users can reach out to you for technical support if needed. Select Assign Devices, then find your devices via the IMEI and select Assign at the bottom. From there, you'll return to your campaign, where your model number, sales code, and firmware versions have all auto-populated. In this scenario, we want to target our XCover Pro for a specific OS update. From the Firmware Version drop-down menu, choose Select from Firmware List. Let's select the August update. Now, select your desired firmware and hit Select at the bottom. Remember, you can only go forward with firmware updates. You can't go backwards from the phone's current firmware state. If you don't see your device firmware listed, you'll have to wait 24 hours for it to populate. If your firmware doesn't appear, please reach out to your Samsung representative or reseller for assistance. Knox eFOTA will take you back to your campaign and the Create and Activate button will be enabled. Now you're done scheduling the update in the eFOTA console. To check the status of your campaign, select Campaigns on the left to see what updates are scheduled. With Samsung Knox eFOTA, you can ensure that OS updates and patches get rolled out to all your mobile devices on the schedule you choose. 